it's your it's question. not a question, but this is something that we didn't really bring up when I asked, I asked the audience. What are your fondest memories of the past year of the podcast, Ian? Honestly, it sounds stupid, but memories one of... Memories like the ones we used to know. Just the fact that we did it, um, and, and we got through it, uh, it was fun to a degree. It wasn't fun <laughs> at all. But it was uh, interesting to see the reaction to the uh, the first part of the stalker story, which may never get a second part. <laughs> um, it's been fun uh, watching you uh, revel in my disdain for Zack Snyder. And Michael Bay. Uh, and Michael Bay. <laughs> <laughs> and and goaded a little bit. Uh, yeah, and, and goaded a I'm little bit. I'm like the bit. provocateur more uh, on, on, the webs- on, the, on the podcast. You really are. You really <laughs> just kind of try to push my buttons. Um, but no, it, it, it kind of goes back to what you say. My, my favorite, it, it's not even a moment, but it's, it's, a, it's an ongoing theme. You and I can discuss topics that we agree on and that we don't agree on, and we can still provide uh, decent viewpoints. Um, I, I enjoyed the funniest thing from the podcast to me was the, I enjoyed the Max story a lot, but you talking about the rude customers and little bitch, oh. how you said that. <laughs> I laugh about that every time I think because I can picture the person saying it to you. People will still text me that, or not text, <laughs> like, uh, they'll still Twitter me that, like, randomly. They'll just be like, little bitch. Um, in terms of, it almost seems like you've had most of the funny moments versus me. I've gone off. I've gone off on resellers, which you try to kind of reel me in back for some whatever reason. I don't. I don't say I don't go off as much as you on stuff. I'm trying to think of one time I really exploded on something, or like really got really. Um, I don't fuck. What is oh, it? Oh, there, like, was, like the, the, there was one time where you said fuck a bunch, and people in the comment section on YouTube were like, "I've never heard Pat swear so much." And I think was, it was, was, it, was the I custom it, manuals, or I think whatever. it was a reseller or something like that. Yeah, it was. It was. It was a. It was a. Guy, it was a reproducer, basically. It was the one doing the CDs. Yeah, I think it might have been that. Was that I mean, it the Snatcher CD. That, that's what got that me. That was a good. That's that what got, good. got my ire up the most. Yeah, that was a good moment. I um, mean, we've had, we've had. I mean, obviously, we had a passing of a, of a friend. We we spoke about. I mean, that wasn't a good moment, but it was memorable. It was a good moment, but it was memorable and important. Um, it's given me a few opportunities to talk about depression and suicide, which are very important topics for me. Sure, uh, it's let me get a lot off my chest, and I realize some people might not like hearing about that stuff, but I don't get a lot of opportunities to just talk about that. So that's been very good for me, whether or not it's been great for everyone else, I don't know, but that's a good memory for me, is being able to get that out there. I remember we had our, our very nice talk about uh, our Christmas memories. Yeah, that, that was, was That fun. was fun. NES Marathon memories before we did the fourth NES that Marathon. Was, that was a lot of That was times. a lot, of, and I gotta start cutting up the NES Marathon moments from the fourth marathon, because don't li- forget the, uh, don't forget the uh, Maniac Mansion Jam session. That's yeah, important. because believe it or not, n- next month, Ian, we gotta start planning the fifth annual NES Marathon in about a month. Well, we gotta start planning we'll it. we get married first. <laughs> no! It's gotta be planned. <laughs> You're gonna get married a month before the marathon's gonna happen this year, so we gotta be planned before that. <laughs> Unfortunately. It's for the kids, Ian. Yeah. Any, any, any other any other memories besides uh, you know Danny providing his his great Danny, mentoring to us? Danny Sullivan has been been a I, true inspiration. I'm not kidding. We're gonna call him at one point in this. We're gonna call up Danny Sullivan and interview him. <laughs> I'm not even kidding. I'll I'll seriously research his career and talk to him. I, I, I think I think I think for the next couple of days, you and I could hashtag favorite you know whatever we wanted to call it. See like, you podcast see, memories. See you podcast memories because right now when. It, it's the same reason you and I don't like to answer favorite questions. You it's know? hard. It, it, it's hard to come up with these things like on the spot. But over the next few days, I bet you Pat and I will come up with some favorite CU podcast moment. Yeah, well, well we moments. went through most of the big hits. I mean, we now on YouTube, we put out about probably 12 to 14 topics every two weeks. That's 28 videos a month. Yeah. Just from the podcast, so. 